how to restring a grooved rimless lens. So we're missing our string here. It's very easy to replace. There's a figure eight at the top that helps hold the lens in. We have our string. We have our scissors. Our ribbon, I prefer a nylon ribbon, and our needle nose. So we're going to start by thre looking at the little holes. There's two holes here at the nasal and two holes here at the outside corner. And we're going to take our rimless string and thread it through the bottom hole. There we go. And then back through the next hole. And this basic lens is held in by tension. So we see we have a little piece of eye wire here. We're going to pull it taut and then tuck that little piece in. Just like that. Tuck it in. So then we're going to come around to the outer hole because sometimes it's hard to determine how long to make the string but this is easy peasy. Go ahead and put it through one of the holes and then we're going to use our lens to measure. Place the lens in the top and thread around the string, around the lens. And then once we do that, we're going to pull it and we're going to cut it flush right at the metal. Now obviously that would not hold the lens in. So now we're going to remove the lens and we're going to thread this outer section back in through the upper hole. Here's where I like to use my needle nose to thread it back in. So here's our little piece and we're going to thread it back in the other hole so then it will be able to be held in by tension. Very good. A little tricky to get it in the hole sometimes. If you can do it by hand, more power to you. And then once you get that in there, go ahead and thread it through. You want just a little bit of that in there. There we go. So we can lay it against the inside of the eye wire. See where it's poking my finger? You want just a little bit. There we go. Pull it taut. And that'll be just the right size and tension to hold in that lens. So now we're going to place the lens at that figure eight, that top section. and hold that in. Use our ribbon to string it. Try to tuck in those ugly edges and then bring it around right through the groove. Hold it. There you go. And then pull out your ribbon. All mounted and ready to go.